yeah got an occult necklace very nice didn't expect that to happen all right guys i'll be coming up on 92 hunter here in a second check this out there it is 92 hunter i got an aviancy task which is awesome so i'm hunting chins and I'm hoping that this is the AVNC task I get. Finally, a chest plate or a chain skirt. But we'll see, guys. Um, I'm gonna be after this task. I'll be about 500 Arma KC. Oh my God! I got an Armadillo chest plate from a minion. Oh my gosh! I'm gonna die. Oh, don't die! Don't die! Don't die! Oh! Ooh, I got a very good elite clue. I got a master scroll book, which I really needed. So now I'll be able to save a ton of bank space. And I also got a royal scepter. How about that fashion scape, yo? Check it out. Oh my god. That fashion scape. Nice. Very good clue. Alright guys, I am very happy to say that I completed the Elite Falador Diary. I would say the killing the knights was a pain. It was really funny because I had master rank for the knights. And I was killing, I think, for over two hours longer than what I need to. So make sure that you check your wanted quest line book uh, quite often because I made that mistake. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and turn this in. I'm not very sure what I'm going to use the 50k on. Um, probably Ruin Crafting right now, uh, because I need 86 for the Karamja Diary, so I'm probably just gonna go ahead and knock that out. I think we talked to this guy. Yes! Awesome! Nice, we get an increase in pay dirt, and we got a nice looking shield. Oh, and I just attacked a knight on accident. Check that out. This looks awesome. Okay. Oh! Get this knight off me, yo. My bad, I didn't mean to attack you like that. Alrighty, so ruin crafting 50k boom and now i'm 140k till the next ruin crafting level and we got that shield very nice now the only diaries i have left is karamja um and the western provinces i could finish the western provinces like today if i wanted to i'd have to go kill all those stupid chompy birds but I think I'm going to take a break, do some raids, and, you know, see how that goes, and maybe get on that. Oh gosh, I'm about to finish the last little part of this diary. Talk to Rance. Give me this. No thanks. Uh, something about these hats. Can I have a hat, please? Show me the bow. I'm happy for you. I get all these fancy hats. Ooh, so fancy. Nice. Um, I don't know which one's my favorite, honestly. I can't really tell the difference. I guess I'll just keep the... I don't know. They're all kind of cool. Huh. Okay, I'll keep this crazy hat. And we will go turn in this diary. This honestly took the longest in my opinion. Um, Falador and definitely this one were very much so a pain, but I would definitely say that this was the worst one. But you know, we got this cool fashion skate hat and now I can go get the pet. I kind of don't feel up to it, but I know I should just knock it out. Okay, here's the gnome child. Elder gnome child. That makes no sense. Elder, but it's a child. Okay, here's your reward. Very nice. We're going to uh, use this in ruin crafting. Check it out. And now we have 89k ruin crafting till 86. And then I'll be able to complete the Karamj diary, which is the last elite diary I have left. Boom shaka light. First master clue ever. Let's see what I got. 291k. Is that bad, Mez? That's pretty low. Right. Um, well, it's a little bit below. It's a little bit below average. But yeah. Bad. Depends on what you got, though. Well, I'm just. I didn't get any uniques, but I'm just glad I got my first one done. All right, guys. I got a hard clue casket. Let's see what I got. 
Ooh, okay, 102k, it could be worse. At least it's like above the 70k range. Not too bad, some alkables. Now I'm gonna go and do an elite. All right, we're gonna be opening this elite casket. Let's see what we get. Ooh, 202k. I mean, like nothing unique, but just stuff. Eh, it could be worse. All right, I should be getting 86 rune crafting here in one second. Uh, this means that I will be able to finally go and complete the Karamja diary, and I will have my achievement diary cape, which is just, oh my gosh. I honestly took forever to do it because, I don't know, I'm kind of lazy. Uh, dude, 86 rune crafting, sexy. I probably will just like stick to rune crafting for a while because like I'm already here and I'm not in a rush to do the Karam Jelly, but I definitely will. Um, maybe later tonight. I'm not very sure yet. 100 raids. Dang, that's sexy. Thank you for raiding with me, guys, for my 500th. Of course. That almost caught up to me. 565. Dang. Alright, we are coming up on, I think it is 95 fletching. Dang, I have been taking a break from RuneScape, guys, for a while. I don't know what it is, but I've uh, been doing some Elder Scrolls online, things like that. But check that out, 95 fletching, and now we can make dragon darts, which is awesome. Um, I plan to get back into this game, though. Sometimes taking a little break is a good refresher, and... I'm going to really get back into scaling and things like that. So hitting that 500 raid mark was a big deal for me because, you know, it just takes hours and hours to do raids. And, but, you know, I think I'm going to stop raiding from now on and just focus on skilling because raiding is really time consuming and it's like a hit or miss for RNG. But 95 fletching, pretty nice. And now we're at 2,153 total level. No, I'm good. I'm so good. Drop that. Drop that. Oh, 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 Yes! Now I've got to go finish this diary. Alright guys, I officially complete, completed the Karamja Elite Diary. I'm going to go ahead and talk to this person to... Oops. To turn it in. Yes. Awesome. Wow. That's incredible. Great. So... I have officially completed all the Elite Diaries, and I'm going to go get my Elite Diary cape, which is sick. Let's go ahead and rub this and put it on, let's say, Agility. I think you get the Achievement Diary cape in Draenor, so I'm going to go do that right now. I brought my 99k. I never have achieved the Achievement Diary cape in this game, and I honestly never thought I would because of the such higher, high requirements, such as 95 sl or. 93 Slayer and etc. But I did, which is phenomenal. Oop, little lag there. Yep, 86 rune crafting was kind of like the little stopping point for me. But finally decided to finish that off. So let's talk to Twiggy O'Corn. That is her name. Oop, whoops. Can I get a cape like yours? Okay, here's 99,000. Very nice. Wow. I never thought I would complete this ever. Let's check out the emote. Wow. Dang, that is insane, guys. Probably the longest emote, too. Whoa. That's awesome. Good stuff. Feels good to get that done. Huzzah, sexy cape. All right here, I'm coming up on 93 woodcut, guys. Dang, oh my gosh, this has been skilling Mondrage. And now I think I'm going to collect bones for getting some prayer levels. So I'm just trying to get some skills for max, but this is how I'm going to end episode 
30 Adventures of an Iron Woman series. I'll see you next time, guys. Massive gains in this video, and I can't wait to see what there is to come. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and please feel free to subscribe to my channel to watch my future videos. And feel free to, walk, to join my clan chat, Sarthon on RuneScape, in order to hang out with me and my friends. Bye, guys.